Hello my friends, welcome to the channel. Since getting new tires, we can actually give a car a little shakedown. Hopefully it doesn't die anywhere. So I'll let it warm up for a few minutes over here. Now we just gotta open up a gate. Take this little bastard out, see how it does. All right, we're warming up slowly. Man, the amount of rattle this thing makes is straight up impressive. As you could tell, this is not designed for people taller than six foot. Still gotta figure out something about the seats because I just can't see myself out across in this comfortably at all. Still have like maybe one good break, maybe two. Be good enough for testing though. Should probably torque the wheels too. Just slap them on. I feel like we have a second axle that's not in the best condition right, right now. Get up to 50. That's not bad. We have a bunch of tools in the back that are making noises. Sounds like it could be the rear one. Test drive. There's something making noise from the sounds of it from here. Could be another wheel bearing. I don't know. It's weird. It sounds like something does, but when it comes down to re revelation, if I had to guess, wheel bearing, I could be wrong. But I mean, if this car this old, you never know. So we'll have to check it out. I'm gonna take the wheel apart and see what's going on. But it's actually drivable in a pinch. You can actually make this your daily driver. It's a break suck. Alright guys, hopefully you enjoyed this update. I'll see you later. Almost forgot. Please support your local animal shelters. Right, Bear Bear? Right, laddie.